I'll show you how to get that perfect bob swing that can only be matched by Edna Mode herself. First, take diagonal back sections that follow the curve of the head. Do that on both sides and clip things up. That's going to give you even weight from the front all the way to the back. You can start in the back or the front. It doesn't matter to me, especially if you're going to create a square bob. We're creating a slightly angled bob here, so I'm starting in the back, working towards the front. It makes things easier when I want things a little bit longer in the front. Do that on both sides. That way you get the entire perimeter shape in in your first section. Then come back with the same curved sections, adding a little bits of weight to that, creating your line all the way through as you run out of pair that reaches. Once you've done both sides, do a wrapping technique, meaning you're going to blow everything in one direction, come to the other side, blow it the other direction, and then you're going to leaf things out to polish and smooth. This works great on fine to medium textures with only a little bit of wave. Sometimes you might have to use an iron to refine. Then you're going to point cut through with vertical point cuts, slowly sliding towards the edge, reducing the weight more and more, creating that perfect Edna mode swing.